We're seeing police charge a man with homicide after two people died on New Year's Day, and now they are trying to track him down. Our Spencer Tracy joins us live from Reruns Lounge. And Spencer, this is where family members say a fight started and someone pulled out a gun. That's right. The family of Avery Stewart, the actual owner here at Reruns Lounge, was not able to go on camera today. But they tell me they hope the power of technology leads to his arrest. This is business. 66 year old Avery Stewart was the owner of Reruns Lounge at 11th and Washington. He was happy. You know, we, had, we was having a good time. It was New Year's, you know, we was enjoying our time together. On New Year's Day, Stewart's grandson, Akeem Stylo, told Fox 6 everything changed when his grandpa was killed. I really can't tell you what happened. I just know that he got caught in the mix of some stuff that happened and he didn't make it. Police say when they arrived, Stewart and a man named Billy Petty were shot and killed. Now reminders of them are left outside the bar. We never expected for something like this to happen. Surveillance video from across the street shows police pulling up to the bar. You know, they got the cameras, you know, they're going to run, you know, look at them and see. Da, da, da. Racine police charged 24 year old Abdullah Rashada with homicide. The U.S. Marshals and police are trying to find him. Silo says they are one step closer to getting justice. We're going to hold strong, you know. That's all we can do. Shot of the man police are looking for is wanted for first degree homicide. If you have any information on his whereabouts, you're asked to call the U.S. Marshals Task Force. Reporting live tonight from Racine, Spencer Tracy, Fox 6 News. Thank you, Spencer.